Alright, what's up YouTube? So, yeah, as you can see, this is going to be this week's project. I got myself a pretty awesome little mini lathe. So, we're going to be setting it up and we're going to be testing it out. And But we'll, we'll get into that in a minute when I get this sorted out. Alright, so as you just saw, just picked up a pretty awesome little mini lathe. I think it's going to be mint for the shop. But basically, the plan for this week's project is going to be a bit of a refresher for myself. Remembering all the little bits and pieces that I picked up along the way on lathe work when I had a big lathe a few years back. But basically, the idea is that I'm just going to be sort of having a bit of fun by also practicing a few things to get ready for a project that I got coming up which is going to be making two wedding rings. So I'm going to be sort of figuring out shape and size and spacings and things like that. But also the other project that I'm going to be doing today is I'm going to be making some sort of teardrop sphere looking sort of little pendants and so uh, that are going to be made out of clear epoxy and ashes. So I'm going to be making them today. So that should be pretty cool. Uh, definitely never used ashes before, but uh, yeah, we'll give it a go and we'll see how it turns out. Should be pretty cool in the end. So, let's get into it. I chopped up some of this and then to the desired length that I wanted and I just did a little tester piece and then so I put a cap on one end and then I basically just filled it with epoxy and the ashes then set it up let it go off then I could just chuck it straight up on the lathe and took the cap off and just chucked it up on the lathe and it was super easy and then just shaped it from there took off all the PVC that was really easy and then just basically put the hole saw on it just to get me an idea of where I wanted to work it and then I sort of when I did the hole saw I poured it on a bit of an angle so I took off more at the bottom of the of the sort of teardrop and then less at the top to give me more material to shape the top and then just shaped it from by hand for the rest and then went to sanding and I went to 240 grit uh, dry and then 240 grit wet as well and then Basically just put some wax on it and I think it turned out really cool and I think the customer's going to really like it And so I got to do another four or five of them, but the rest are going to be a bit smaller than the one that I did But I'm not going to worry about showing that as it's basically the same process for all the rest So I think it turned out pretty cool and yeah, I'll throw up a quick little video here of how it looks and uh, Yeah, that's basically it. Oh, and I'm feeling really good about the rings. So that's good because they're coming up soon I got some cool ideas for that and so yeah if you want to hit like that'd be sick if you want to hit subscribe that'd be awesome till the next video peace